Hey guys, I'm here with uh, Nick the Ghost Gonzalez, who's a day away from fighting DJ Fuentes at UWF1. Uh, Nick, you've been, uh, it's been a long time coming. Um, you guys have been in a collision course for some time now. Um, how does it feel to finally have the opportunity to lock it up with DJ? Um, I mean, it's, it's uh, contrary to what he said. It's not something I've been really pursuing. Uh, it doesn't really interest me to be the STFC featherweight, whatever champion he is. Uh, it was a thrown out there by Paulo Meda, but you know when he was in control of the SCFC, having to be in the contract at the time, and uh, it's kind of past it. And then when I moved back to Texas, I called the SCFC, found out I was new manager or new guys in charge or stuff. And so I was like, well, they always wanted me to fight this guy. Is he available? Oh, he's got a match already. Oh, that's about it. It's nothing I've been really wanting to pursue. Uh, I'm just happy that I'm on the card at a new show like this. I think DJ is a great fighter. Um, it just happens he's to bone it, you know. So that's it. Uh, you're fighting out of Austin, Texas, right? Uh, but you do have some ties in the Rio Grande Valley. Yeah. Uh, can, can you t tell us about that a little bit? Yeah, it's actually, uh, check this out, cameraman. I got right there. That's Coach Randall Madsen. He's the uh, head wrestling coach at Nikki Rowe High School. He was a head wrestling coach at PSJ High School. I attended there uh, 97, 98, my sophomore, junior year. Uh, my dad's from uh, Westlaco. Got a lot of family here. So, it's you know, I spent years and years here vacationing. I actually lived here two years, so. It's like a second home to me, man. I'm really excited to fight in front of my uh, my uncle, my grandfather, my cousins and stuff, friends that I stayed in touch with at uh, PSJA Bears. So it's really exciting for me to come back and fight. As a former PSJA Bear, uh, I'm very excited for this fight also, man. Go, go. Um, hell yeah. We're going to go tear down the fucking Oso Dome tonight. <laughs> okay, um, I guess uh, any last words for DJ before we go? Uh, no, I just hope he's um, trained hard and he's uh, ready for a tough fight because I'm about uh, to go in there and bring it. Awesome, man. Well, thank you so much for the interview. Good luck tomorrow. All right. Thank you. See ya.